Okay. When I tell people that I don't agree with the government forcing to uh, forcing people to bake cakes, mm -hmm. gay couples, mm -hmm. I get pie in the face. And do you think people, namely the progressive left establishment gays, like to pick the rights they want and criticize the ones that they don't want? I mean, is freedom an a la carte? Thing. Well, no one ever, no one has ever accused the progressive left of being <coughs> logically consistent for good reason. Um, no, I, th I don't think the, you know, I mean, look, you can have endless. I mean, I'm not the right guest to have, you know, complex debates about whatever, whatever. I'm a cultural critic, and what I'm interested in is hypocrisy and how things are covered and how how um, things are, are written up in the media. Um, you know, how stories spiral out of control, and what and and, and cultural movements and 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 and, and what makes me so humiliated and furious and disappointed and embarrassed to be gay, frankly, is the odious behavior of these awful activists who punish and ridicule um, and malign and abuse these lovely Christian families who just say, you know what, I'd rather not. And you get these reporters who will just call around the Midwest desperately trying to find someone somewhere who says, I'd probably rather not bake a, you know, cake for a lesbian wedding or something like that, or I'd probably rather not give you a pizza. I've gone out and met these people. You can go on my YouTube, you can see. I see when I met the guys from Memories Pizza. These aren't hateful bigots. These aren't like backward redneck monsters. They're just people with different principles from yours. Leave them alone. Doesn't no make one, you anti-gay. No, it is bothering you. And having that opinion doesn't make me self-loathing. It just means different people like different things, believe in different things, and have different priorities. Leave them alone. They're leaving you alone. The problem with the gay establishment is they're going out looking for, to, to pick fights because they know they can, because well, you, they can bully other people as they used to be bullied. And it's very interesting to me. It's always very revealing to me how groups behave when they acquire power. And the gay lobby now has supreme, unassailable power in the media. They can do anything to anyone, and journalists will back them. And what do they do that with that power? They go out and they bully Mom and pop pizza stores. How pathetic. These these angry, vitriolic, ugly, odious lesbian couples will go out and bully Christians just because they can. I think it's disgusting.